Hey YouTube, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kid and you watching. So this is the very first cash stuffing of the year. Super excited because I am going to be stuffing some more of my savings challenges. Um, yeah, so let's just go ahead and jump into this video. I'll be stuffing $456 this week, today for this week. So I got $600 from my husband, $34 from child support. So that's a total of $634 in income this week. And, um... Bills I have to pay this week is rent, water, um, Sims is, I play The Sims 3, it's a game that I play, if you guys don't know what that is, and I pay $6 a month for, like, custom content and stuff, and then the rental, uh, we have a building outside that we pay for every, um, month, so our bills total to be $345, so if you track the bill money, and I owe $71 to rent, I did use some rent money, so I did owe $71 to rent, you just track bills in the IOU and you get 218. Um, and then when you add back in the rent and the water, because those are the two bills that I do stuff on camera, the rest of them is in the bank. We get a total of 456 that we are going to be cash stuffing this week. So that would be eight dollars in cash envelopes, 138 in sinking funds, and like I said, um the rent and water. And that'll equal to 456. And then we, we will have um some money for my holidays binder, which is full of savings challenges. And it'll be $20 of rollover money, which you guys will see in just a minute where that came from. So starting off with cash envelopes, I'll be stuffing gas and takeout. So this is where the um, money for holidays is coming from, the rollover money. I have $20 of rollover money from gas again this week. Yeah, I don't know what's been going on with me not using all my gas money, but I'm not complaining. I think it's because um, of my son being out of school. I think that's the reason why. So, um, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 is going into my holidays binder. I'm just sitting that right there. And then we'll be putting in $70. $70 into gas. That's a 50 and a 20. These twins are stuck together. All right. So that's a 50 and a 20. Hopefully the lighting isn't too bad because the um the sun is doing the most right now outside. <laughs> I'm sitting right in front of a window. So that is 70. Okay, that is 70 in gas. And then takeout, we'll be getting ten dollars. Be one ten. All right, and putting that away, I have a dollar over in spending, and I would just put that to the side for um my dollar jar. Here, I'll just set it up here with this. All right. So that is it for cash envelopes. Go ahead and put 10. I have a total of $80 that is in um cash envelopes. So we're gonna go ahead and move on to my holidays. All right, so holidays. All right, skipping 4th of July because I only have $20 and I only have a increment, so 50 and 25, so I can't do that one. We be stuffing Valentine's Day. We put in five dollars. All right. Um, let's go ahead and take that five out now, and then I'm just gonna color that in. All right. So I got that colored in. Now it has thirty dollars in Valentine's. Alright, right, moving on to skipping mode. They going to Easter. Alright, so Easter I'll be putting in ten dollars. So that'll be two fives. Go ahead and write. That's fifteen. Fifteen there, and I'll just go ahead and color two of these eggs in. All 
All right, got all those colored in. Like I said, it's 15 in Easter. All right, and Father's Day, we'll be getting $4. That'd be four ones, two, three, four. Y'all, the sun just came back out again. Look, and it went back out. Oh, goodness. Five, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve dollars in Father's Day. All right, I'll just go ahead and color in. I think I'm going to do two and a two. Instead of the last four ones, I'm just do two and a two. All right, got those two colored in. Went all out the lines, but it'll be okay. It'll be okay. All right, I think we have one more, which is New Year's. So my New Year's one is um, always going to be stuff every week because it's the 52 weeks challenge. So we'll be putting in one dollar. Go ahead and color that in now. All right. So one dollar in a New Year's. Alrighty. One dollar there. That's it for my holidays binder. I'm just going to get my calculator out and calculate how much we have. So we have $83 in $83 saved in holidays. Now we're gonna move on to sinking funds. All right, so this is my first sinking funds binder. Wait a minute. Y'all used the wrong money. All right, y'all. So I figured out what happened. I got my denominations right. I was supposed to be grabbing from up there with the holidays, but all right, we're good. So church is getting five. So that's a $5 bill. Oh, I was losing my mind there for a second. Five in church. All right, house is getting $10. That's a five and five ones. One, two, three, four, five. Now it says ten in house. Mason's getting ten. So he has ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Okay. Next is Kobe, he's getting 10 as well. Another $10 bill. So he, y'all, it must be cloudy outside. <laughs> All right, 20, 30, 41. Gotta get Kobe a haircut. All right. And moving on to grocery, I'll be putting in a hundred and three dollars. A hundred. One, two, three. So grocery is one hundred, five, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. One fifteen. All right. I think that's it for this one. Yep. So now I just got the stuff, um, the bills, and my other sinking funds binder. All right. So rent will be fully funded today with five fifty because it is due. This is rent for this month. So I have to add in two oh eight. That's two hundred five and three ones. There we go. Okay, so this should be 550, 1, 2, 3, 4, 455, 20, 40, 
So that is a fully funded. And then water bill. I'm not sure how much it is still, but I'm going to put in 30. Um, hopefully that's enough. It should be enough. I hope it's enough, y'all. <laughs> if not, I'll just have my husband cover the wrist. <laughs> All right. So that is it for my binders. All right, now we're going to add up all our sinking funds. So, in total, I have $207 saved in sinking funds right now. All right, now we're going to move on to my cash jars. So, I'm going to go ahead and roll up this $1 bill. All right, that is it for the $1 going in there. And then with my change jar, this is the change that I have for this week. Not very much. I just pour it in there. And that's it for this video, you guys. I hope y'all enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will talk to y'all for the very next video. Bye, guys.